Manos Vasamakis and Sotiris Ayus, they're moderating the session, Transforming Treasury Operations, Deep Dive into Solutions and Best Practices. Okay. Hello, everyone. Uh, welcome today to a very different and interesting discussion. Uh, so let's take a moment and think about an ideal world where a bank is approaching you as a treasurer and is asking you uh, about your concerns, about your day-to-day -day issues, about your expectations and what has to be improved in terms of banking services so you can make your work easier, faster and more efficient. So let's imagine about an open and <coughs> honest uh, brainstorming session where Treasurers can freely express their thoughts, their opinion, and their issues. The bank is actually is listening to them, understanding their needs, and eventually is addressing uh, these issues. So, is this some kind of science fiction uh, scenario or something that could really happen? Um, so, let's watch uh, a short video and realize that really nice things can happen once treasurers and a bank sit together at the same table and discuss. Okay, coming back to our panel, um, me and Sotiris, uh, together with two distinguished guests from uh, Eurobank, uh, Olympia Krisotaki, uh, Head of Transaction Banking Solutions, welcome Olympia. Thank you. And uh, George Panu, Head of Innovation Center, welcome George. Good morning to all. Uh, we are very thrilled today to be here and discuss about a very a pioneering initiative that took place the previous months that uh, targeted the transformation and the optimization of uh, treasury operations. Uh, so uh, we are very excited that today we are able to share with all of you the initiative, uh, this initiative and the outcome of uh, this initiative which is a result of a very open discussion uh, between members of uh, the Cash Management Working Group and Eurobank. Thank you, Manos. Good, uh, good morning, everyone. Uh, so, Olivia, I think everyone is a little bit like, uh, excited what we are going to say. Can you give us an overview on the brainstorming workshop goals and the teams involved? Yes, uh, thank you for the question. Good morning to everyone. The primary goal of the workshop was to identify and tackle the needs and the problems that the modern treasurers face in their daily operations. As we said in the beginning, this was the first time that both treasurers and executives of the bank sit together in one virtual or physical room uh, to discuss ideas, to describe and define problems, to exchange knowledge, expertise, experience and propose solutions. This uh, challenging initiative was supported by the Group uh, Banking Digital General Division as well as Transaction Banking of Eurobank. As a bank, as you probably know, it's part of our culture to be pioneers as well as at the same time always listen to what the customer needs. 
In this challenging initiative, we work together very productively with 19 executives from Hellenic Association of Treasurers, as well as to 24 executives of the bank. I strongly believe that the outcome of this session was very useful for both parties. Personally, I really enjoy the journey. I said it before also <laughs> between us. I enjoy the journey and I'm looking forward for what's next. Okay, so George, let's deep dive a bit more and provide some more details about this uh, brainstorming session. So how these sessions were conducted and what kind of methodologies were used. Thank you, Manos. Uh, in Eurobank, we are open uh, in new ideas and especially in the innovation center where really uh, innovation happens. And I remember uh, vividly that uh, when uh, executives from transaction banking called me and uh, they asked for um, a structured uh, problem management solution. So uh, it was time for action. Me and my team, Dimitras Pathula and uh, Nikos Kalivyotis, uh, created a personalized uh, methodology, especially for you, the Hellenic Association of Treasurers. Um, this is something that shows the devotion and dedication of Eurobank and our team. Uh, towards to you, our uh, partners and uh, customers. Although uh, the traditional uh, way of uh, creating a brainstorming session is through a physical workshop, uh, we got a gift from uh, COVID and we decided to, to have the session uh, uh, virtually. So uh, we had to find uh, the proper tools uh, to use. and. Um, we selected uh, a tool that was appropriate for creating an interactive session, uh, supporting a lot of people, because we had um, 19 people from uh, HUT and uh, 24 people from, uh, from Eurobank. Uh, we combined several innovative uh, methodologies uh, to this brainstorming session, a, a real innovation happening. And uh, that included uh, real-time uh, collaboration tools, uh, sticky notes, real-time voting, and um, uh, visual aids in order to enhance our discussions. Uh, we focused on the structure. The, the next thing that we did, uh, we thought that we should focus on the structure, and that is uh, when we decided uh, to split uh, the whole session into uh, different uh, uh, virtual sessions in order to support um, the whole process. Uh, and uh, it was uh, to mention that um, each group uh, uh, included subject matter experts from, uh, use, uh, from Eurobank, uh, especially, especially for uh, supporting better all the requests that uh, were, were done immediately. Um, what uh, really came to our mind was to, that we wanted to, to select the themes. So we need to, uh, to select the themes and uh, we asked you uh, what were the main problems uh, that Cash Management Workgroup uh, included. Uh, after that, uh, you uh, wrote down in sticky notes, a very innovative way, uh, all the problems. And uh, we ask you to vote uh, on these uh, problems. Due to lack of time, because we had uh, almost uh, two hours for each session, uh, we decided to uh, select six plus six problems that we would um, uh, discuss and uh, find the solutions and the pain points. Uh, after that, uh, when we finished the whole session, uh, we took homework and um, uh, together with uh, transaction banking experts, senior executives, uh, executives from uh, digital, uh, we gave solutions and uh, we were amazed that most of these problems were supported by uh, Eurobank solutions already. Uh, so, uh, the next step was to, to have a, a physical workgroup where uh, we invited you all to our uh, Eurobank Conference Center. And uh, again, with our experts, we demonstrated the solutions that um, uh, were supported already. 
and uh, to show you the, the devotion, uh, except from, are the, from the senior executives, also our chief digital officer, uh, Mr. Harris McDallis, participated actively uh, to this process. Uh, personally, I found it very, uh, I was very happy and it was very an enjoyable uh, session. So, uh, I had a question for you, Sotiris and Manos. Uh, how did you came up with these themes? I mean, what were uh, the, the main problems that uh, made you uh, select these, uh, these um, issues? Well, George, uh, we as a working group, we started to identify the themes, not only that we face in our day-to-day -day work, but uh, also themes that could facilitate us in the future in order to improve our quality of work and needed attention. Each of these themes uh, are very crucial to us because uh, uh, for our uh, timeless effort uh, to improve our quality and our, lexen uh, and our lexenses in our day-to-day uh, -day work. So, uh, in order to have time to focus on our in our strategic role as treasurers. Uh, but now let's uh, highlight the main themes, Manos. Yeah, so as you can see, we had quite a lot of issues to discuss. Uh, and all of the uh, cash management working group members were divided into two separate groups and each group focused on different kind of themes and number of issues. Um, the first group focused a lot on the transformation and improvement of payment processes, something very important uh, for all treasurers. Um, moreover, we focus a lot on automating several treasury processes and uh, also improving and optimizing uh, web banking services, which is a very crucial and critical tool in the hands of a treasurer. The second group, on the other hand, focused on uh, how we can improve our cash management techniques. We discussed about payment factories, customization, uh, in-house banking and lastly this group uh, worked a lot on uh, discussing about uh, cash flow forecasting how we'll be able to provide more accurate and efficient uh, cash flow forecasting reports and how we can get more efficient uh, actuals directly from the bank um, so having all said all that George which were the main problems that uh, were identified uh, during these uh, sessions? Okay. Uh, in, in these two hours, because we have, uh, in the beginning, we had uh, these uh, two digital sessions, uh, we spent uh, two hours in each session and we identified a total of 60 problems. An amazing number. Uh, no. I, I, couldn't, I couldn't believe. Uh, uh, that we should have so, so many problems. And uh, the most amazing part of this was that 19 out of uh, 60, almost 31%, uh, was already, uh, could already be uh, tackled by, by Eurobank services. So uh, the key issues included uh, the need for better relationship uh, management with the bank. I think this is a, a main problem. Uh, another issue was uh, fee comparison tools. So, where do I get uh, uh, the best fees? Uh, cash flow reporting, everyday business of a treasurer, improvements, and uh, enhanced bulk payment functionalities. Uh, these problems, as we discussed earlier, were prioritized uh, against uh, uh, your needs and uh, they saw the, the impact uh, they have on the everyday life uh, of the treasurer. Uh, it's important that to, to say that, um, because I said that we, have, uh, we took homework, um, we're going to return with uh, the rest uh, problems, that we're going to work on them, it's a work in progress, and return with solutions. Okay, thank you, George. So, Olivia, George mentioned all of the problems uh, that were uh, specified. Could you please highlight some specific problems and the proposed solutions? Yes, actually, 60 problems, it's a huge Jeez. number. Um, the most difficult part in uh, this is to define the problem. It's half of the journey. 
It's half of the journey. We as Eurobank, as we said before, we had solutions for some of them. So you help us by defining your problems in order to answer to you, to give you feedback and to upgrade, even upgrade our services. That's how we collaborate effectively. Let me now highlight some of the issues that you have identified during this workshop. Uh, the first one is uh, account owner verification. By account owner verification, we mean the process of validating the account holder, the payee, the beneficiary before, this is the key, the processing of a payment. Um, I understand, it's, we all understand, that's very crucial for your job to have this, uh, this account owner verification due to mitigation of risk, preventing errors, and of course, facilitating your day-to-day -day business. We in Eurobank, we can provide account owner ver verification through APIs functionality in collaboration with third parties for domestic payments. I have to note that it's, it's in the agenda to expand this service to international payments as well as bulk payments. Another issue that you mentioned, we will see later. But at this point, I have to note something about account owner verification. As you probably know, account owner ver verification is a, is a globally stated issue and problem under the umbrella of payments. We in Eurobank pay attention to all market trends, all initiatives up there that, and we are trying to find the one that best suits your needs. Let's move to the other uh, issue uh, you mentioned, it's uh, bulk payments. You ask us how we can uh, provide you a more efficient way to monitor bulk payments. Some of you uh, set about one registry for the whole file. We can do this. We also are going to connect automatically the entries to your ERPs. Moreover, let's move to another uh, subject. Time deposit. We talked about that uh, during the workshop about the liquidity management tools. Time deposit. You mentioned a lot about time deposit. How do you feel if you could have a time deposit through your e-banking 24-7 in less than two minutes, whenever you want. This is something that we have in Eurobank. If you are a customer of the bank and if you are e-banking customer, you can visit e-banking and you can deposit money of the company to your time deposit account with the same characteristics will you have in the physical world. I suggest you try it and, and share with us the experience. We always appreciate and take value of your feedback. Um, the problems you have was very diverse. Now I'm going to say uh, one word for, for example, prepaid cards. Another issue, you said you want the issuing of the prepaid cards to be more effectively, more easy, more quick. We can provide this now by our web banking functionalities. You can ask us, it's something that is there for you. Um, but now I believe that is the time, uh, I said in the beginning, that I really enjoy the journey. This is the time that I should ask Sotiris and Manos to honestly tell us how they feel <laughs> about this whole new experience. Well, uh, Olivia, thank you. I think it was unique, it was inspiring, it was innovating. I think uh, it changed the banking relationship landscape. It was the first time uh, that we treasurers can uh, tell our problems without hesitation, without limitation. Now I'm thinking about your kind of our treasury psychologist. <laughs> I hope you don't uh, charge us in the SOB session. Uh, I remember the first time that uh, we talk about uh, this uh, initiative, everyone was very excited. Uh, I think uh, it is the way, the new way that banks should operate in order to find solutions. They must talk to their clients honestly. Everyone's effort was major, such as uh, for our uh, fellow treasurers as the executives from Eurobank, and I think everyone enjoyed uh, this initiative and uh, we will continue this journey. Yeah, I totally agree with you, Sotiri. Um, to also mention that uh, I believe that this kind of project was a win-win situation for both treasurers and 
the bank. Um, from one hand, the treasurers could freely express their opinion, their expectations, uh, their problems, and on the other hand, your bank, uh, you know, listen to the treasurers, uh, understand <coughs> their needs, and uh, you know, uh, give your bank the opportunity to understand what needs to be done in order to adapt better to the modern treasury operations. And, you know, having a banking partner that is listening to you, is listening to your problems, and eventually is trying a lot to resolve these issues is something priceless and very valuable. Um, for me, uh, it's very important to mention at this point that these kind of sessions should not stop here. Um, we should maintain these uh, workings in the future, and this initiative should be the pilot for further discussions with all the Greek banks. Well, thank you all for contributing your, your insights in this remarkable initiative. I think uh, it is clear with, through innovation and collaboration, Eurobank is leading the way in addressing the challenges in modern treasury. Let this be the spark of something greater. HAT, alongside with Eurobanks, stands uh, ready to continue this journey, exploring and driving through the next phase of transformation. But I think it is time for everyone here to be a part of this initiative. So take a couple of minutes and uh, take part in our next poll. You can see seven uh, problems that were identified and uh, we need your collaboration in order the banks should uh, to prioritize their effort for improvements for the future that we all will, will uh, save together. Can, can we have the poll, please? May, may, ha may we have the poll, please, on the board? Thank you. Okay, while we are... This is not the poll. Okay. <laughs> we <laughs> while can we answer are, this question. We are going to answer this question, but we need uh, <laughs> someone to show the poll, because we have something prepared for you. Okay. Please vote. What you think is the most important for uh, the treasurers? Okay. Now we're talking. Now we're talking. <laughs> Maybe Manus and Sotiris, you could have uh, a comment on the results. We're <laughs> going to give a few seconds more. I think the yeah. user right is winning, but also... And we're also going to get this uh, as feedback when we get back. Yes. We have homework to do. Yes. <laughs> the second yeah. round of uh, this. Yes. Yes. While this poll is yes. on and progress, we had uh, some of these issues actually were discussed uh, during the sessions, but it is very nice to know that the audience is agreeing, is in agreement with uh, what has been discussed during these uh, sessions. So there. Yes. I think the user right is winning for that. We, we saw a very nice demo, uh, and if someone wants to see it, uh, feel free to contact us about improving the process. We have a super user functionality on our website, so this is something that we already have. We said that we'll, you find solution for us in the sport. <laughs> <laughs> we said we have 19 solutions. We <laughs> well, 
I think, I think uh, we are okay with the call. Okay. So, um, let me take the opportunity again and uh, thank you all for this uh, uh, great uh, idea. Uh, together with transaction banking, we created something that didn't exist before. And I would like also to uh, give a, a warm congratulations to the Hellenic Association of Treasurers. I think, in my experience, I've been to several uh, events. This may be the best uh, global, uh, because you, you are a global uh, uh, association now, and uh, wish you the best for uh, every year to be better and bigger. Okay. Thank you. Thank you very much.